These doors have completely transformed the look of this U-Force 1000. These are the Super ATV doors, and man, do they look great. They're built so well, and they fit perfect on the U-Force 1000. And man, I love the way they look. They're super good quality doors, very well made, and that's what you expect uh, from Super ATV. And man, that looks so good. Fit and finish is great. We're gonna show you here in just a moment how to install these doors. But first off, just take a look at these. You got the latch uh, that's just inside the door right there. And look, you would think I've had doors and aftermarket doors in the past that would rattle and stuff. But when you install these correctly, these doors here do not rattle at all. They're, they're strong and reinforced supported. You can see the tubing that goes all the way around the door and the, the support here. You got a bracket here and up here at the top that fits in perfectly with your OEM plastics. And you have a support down here in the bottom that applies pressure to the lower bar and that's what keeps you from rattling and uh, man it is nice very nice door no rattling and uh, we're gonna do a lot of riding in this thing but man it, it and look as far as room getting in and out if you notice the hinges are way farther back and so you have optimum room getting in and out of this uh, U-Force 1000 and uh, Joel, if you'll sit in it, you can see how it's the perfect height for probably the average size American man. <laughs> and uh, just a good seating position, plenty of room. And uh, what I'm going to like about it is when I'm driving the family and the kids, we have a lot of needed protection here with these doors. Um, plenty of space, looks good. So we're about to show you how to install these Super ATV doors on a U-Force 1000. And we'll show you step by step how to do that. Uh, remember that you can order these Super ATV doors at Main Street Cycle. Just call the number down in the description and they can get you hooked up, man, with anything from Super ATV right at Main Street Cycle. So let's go install these doors. So in your Super ATV door uh, kit package, it's gonna have everything that you need, all your hardware nice and organized, and everything was wrapped so good. This is your hardware, this is it. So you got your brackets and uh, for each side, and you got your doors wrapped up super good in the box. Uh, so there's absolutely no scratches or anything, but here's, here's the tools that we're going with. So uh, this is what it'll look like. So now we're going to show you how to install the Super ATV doors for your U-Force 1000. Uh, so you're going to want to definitely go ahead and uh, lift your dump bed up. Uh, Joel's going to take this side cover off. Just going to pop that out. That reveals a what, 10, 10 millimeter bolt. Take that out. Then there's going to be three plastic clips here. Okay. Body panel clip there. Body panel clip, two of them on the back side. And that's going to allow you to remove that. You're going to need it here in a little bit. But that's going to reveal the spot for your, your main bracket for the door. And it looks like this. These are three 12 millimeter bolts that come with it. And it's slotted so you'll have room for adjustment but we have found in installing these doors that you're going to kind of want to go ahead and tighten them jokers up and the best position is near about all the way all the way back huh yeah so all the way back yes yeah. so before all the way you back go and before you tighten them this panel has to be slid into this take this off first and make it hold up Got to come off either way. Oh yeah, yeah. Take your. You can take this off. Uh, you, what, yeah, 
you have to take it off to give yourself some room and uh, to be able to work that piece of plastic back on. And you can either put them back on at the end of this or you can leave them off. Uh, it's up to you, personal preference. <clears throat> so now before you put the plastic piece, uh, bolt it back in, you've got to remember to tighten these three bolts up back here. What size is that? They're 12 millimeter. 12 millimeter. And you'll slide your bracket all the way back. you go ahead and secure yeah. that we'll be done here so we'll just go ahead and put our clips and everything back again and so three plastic body panel clips and then one 10 millimeter bolt that will go right here Now we can move to mounting the door. So you're going to want to take your mirrors off. What size is that, Joe? Six millimeter. Six Allen millimeter head. Allen head. Take your mirrors off and you're going to immediately put the bracket where the latch bracket on. And you're going to use, go back with the same hardware that's already there. Fits, fits in perfectly. And anything from here on, we're gonna leave a little bit loose until we get it all fit right. Okay, so this is your door latch bracket. That's how it should look. Now we're gonna go ahead and put the hardware in that the latch is gonna latch up to. It's going to be bolt, nut, and this nut will, it's for to adjust this how far in and out you need to go with it. And then you got a lock washer on the bottom and a nut. And you can fine tune adjust that once you get your door mounted and figure out the best place for it to latch up to it. That's about how it should look until we get ready to tighten her down. Yeah, we'll go ahead and put our, this piece on here. It's two 10 millimeter bolts on the side of their seat. These are different on each side, so you'll have to figure out which one goes where. them loose also. All right, that's how that should look at this step. And there's a bracket for each side, just like this, mirrored image. It's slotted right here at the top, and you'll see what we're gonna do with that here in just a moment. Then you have four Allen head bolts that'll go here on this to hold the door on. What'll work good set it up here and actually latch the front then you don't have to try to hold it latch the front up so Joel is showing you how you can do it one person can install these it definitely helps with two but it can be done just you. or you can get them installed right here at Main Street Cycle don't want to tighten these all the way up yet, right? Nope. Okay. And that hardware comes in the kit. Now we'll open the door back up. And on our bracket we put in here. All right, this is the bottom part of your, the back side of the bracket. This, this hardware comes in. 
leave them open. Alright, that's how that should look at this point. Remember, we're leaving that loose. This back part is still loose as well. I'm going to line up the latch now. Alright, now we're going to go ahead and get this tight so our bracket ain't moving. Both of these. And then once we get this adjusted where it's shutting pretty good, we're going to go ahead and tighten our latch up. And after it's shutting good, we're going to go, we're going to tighten all this other stuff we've left loose. And then we're, while it's black, so you ain't got nothing hanging while you tight. And then we'll come back and make sure it still shuts good or adjust it if we need to. but we're gonna put this little stopper in here and just stop that. Now we're gonna be putting the uh, door rest in, the door stopper, uh, which is gonna support the bottom of the door and keep it from vibrating and flapping everywhere. It's just gonna put, this just puts pressure on the bottom of the bracket uh, or the bottom of the door frame right here. It's gonna push against that and keep the door from vibrating. Put the camera in there and see. Oh yeah. See how it's pushing against it there? That's gonna keep it from rattling. That's perfect. All right, so uh, that's a successfully installed door for your U-Force 1000. This is a Super ATV door. And uh, if you would like to order yours, you can order it through Main Street Cycle. Uh, you can order any of your Super ATV uh, accessories for your CF Moto from Main Street Cycle. Just call the number down in the description. and uh, Or you can also go to the website, MainStreetCycle.com. Check them out, get the number there. But I uh, hope this was helpful and we showed you how to install this door on your U-Force 1000. And boy, it looks sweet. So. Uh, Hope you enjoyed it, and uh, we're going to go test these out on the trails and see how they do. So stay tuned, God bless, and remember to keep it real. See you in the next one. And man, I love the way they look. They're super quality. Super quality, what an idiot. <laughs> and order these doors today for your youth. Ah, your force. Your force. You to change yours. I'm just your force. Your force 1000. All right, here we go. So you can get over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, all right. So we're about to show you how to install these Super ATV doors on your. your... <laughs> I can't say it. All right, here we go. <laughs> Just say on AU Force. On AU Force, yes, thank you. Thank you. Alright, so we're gonna show you how to install these super ATV doors on AU. <laughs> <laughs>